Hey, what's going on, world? It is your boy, and we are back with another Lux Chat. What is happening? I know it's been a little minute since we've done uh, a Lux Chat, but I've been focusing on them reels. I've been having fun with them, too. And um, y'all been engaging. I appreciate that engagement and everything. Uh, so those have been pretty fun. But I said I need to get in here with another Lux Chat to uh, talk to you all, God. To talk to you all, excuse me, and let you all know what's going on. So first things first, we've hired our first employee. Yeah. You know, you know, you know, clap it up, clap it up. Yeah, his name is DJ and he has been here. So what is this? Two weeks, I believe that he's been working with us now. So we are getting the Lux headquarters set up and everything. Once we get that taken care of, we'll give you all a tour. He has him on a, a desk. So he's official and he's now the one that's recording the reels and doing all this. So he is learning or honing his skills in videography and photography and everything. And so when we were leaving a client yesterday after our session was uh, over, he had made a comment and said that a hundred percent, what is it? hundred percent of the shots you don't take. No, you miss a hundred percent of the shots you don't take. All right. You miss 100% of the shots that you don't take. And that got me thinking, I'm like, you know what, you got a point. I mean, I've heard it before, but he said it so eloquently, you know what I'm saying? It's stuck. I'm gassing him up a little bit, y'all. He's right behind the camera too, so that's what I'm looking at. So uh, yeah, it stuck with me because of the way he said it and everything. So I said, I just wanted to get in here and talk to you all about that because I think that is so true. You know, we get paralyzed a lot of times about, what is it, analysis paralysis, right? And we overthink things, we don't move because we're like, ah, what if this happens? What if that happens? Guess what? A lot of it's gonna happen and it's okay. You know what I'm saying? But you gotta get moving. You gotta take the shot. If you don't take the shot, it's a guaranteed miss. But if you take it, hey, you got a 50-50 chance. You know what I'm saying? And if you miss, guess what? That ain't nothing but a lesson. But anyway, you know, I've been talking to several entrepreneurs because the content that I'm putting out, they have questions for me or they're telling me their story and everything. And one thing that's a recurring theme is, you know, it has to work or it has to work there's no in between there's no other options it has to work there is no plan b you do not need to set a plan b if you set a plan b for instance by saying yo either this is gonna have to work or i'll go get me a job at the bank i'll go get me a job you know working for uber i'll get me a part-time at starbucks the moment that you put that in your mind you've already set that in stone or set that in motion so focus on this business has to work we have to get this thing to go you know by any means necessary um y'all probably have seen the reel now that i made i did i'm sure i posted i recorded it today but i'm sure i'm going to post it before i post this video is that you have to move you have to move forward and you have to trust in your goal but you can always switch up your method you know so if your goal is this and you choose this method to get there and that method isn't getting you close to it well guess what you can switch up your method the goal is a non-negotiable but then that method is what's flexible so go to method b and hopefully method b will get you to that point if that ain't working do a combination of both whatever it is you just focus on getting yourself back to the goal you know what i'm saying and i'm gonna tell you something that the mind is powerful you know it's a powerful thing and whatever you put in it is what's going to manifest so if you say it's gonna happen this is a go guess what it's a go if you say i gotta have a plan b guess what you're gonna have to have a plan b the choice is yours you know and you need to be mindful and uh conscious of the thoughts that are in your head uh i thought i heard a stat one time maybe forty thousand or 40 million i don't remember the exact number but it was a high number of the thoughts that we have throughout any given day you have so much information coming in and out right but the ones that you want to retain and pay attention to are the ones that you're telling yourself you know what you're telling yourself about yourself what you're telling yourself about your goals because whatever you're telling yourself 
about you and your goals is what's going to manifest. If you're focusing on failure and that I don't know if this is going to work, there's other people that are better than me, there's this, there's that, etc. Guess what? That's what's going to happen. But if you say, yo, I'm going to make this thing happen. I got to make something shake. Guess what? Something going to shake a little bit. You know what I'm saying? That's all I got, man. I ain't want to stay too long, but I just wanted to come in with a quick chat and tell y'all, take the shot. That's all you got to do. All right? Till the next one. Peace. Peace.